ladies and gentlemen i have the wayfang tripod here and in this video we'll be unboxing this i'll also be showing you some other cool items i got to help me create better videos for this channel and for my sewing channel oh forgive my manners you welcome back to my channel my name is kemi omorube if you're seeing this face for the very first time prior to this time i've always made use of this tripod and i've used it for like two years but the downside of it is this side keeps pulling off i think it's probably due to use it so it just keeps pulling off and most time i'm afraid my phone may fall off guys i use phone to record my videos so i needed something that would be sturdy that i can use for phone so i've used it for a while now but it's not a very strong one so it has broken in between i have packed and the handle here has broken and then i need to film video on tabletop for my sewing channel and whenever i do that this just goes all the way down that is no longer i don't know it's no longer firm enough to stay in the position it just goes all the way down and okay this is not very strong but it's less expensive than the wayfine tripod i just got and um so if you're starting off this still okay you can still so use aside getting a tripod i also got this recently i'll be putting up a link above where i did the review for this prior to now i used the boya by m1 but i kind of upgraded to this should i call it an upgrade because sincerely i'm not using it that much now even though the sound may be a little less noisy than Boya by MM1, which is a lavalier microphone, the particular one I have clipped on right now. But then, because this is closer to my mouth, I found out that the audio comes out way sharper than this one does. And this one just has to be with the phone. So if the phone is far away from you, you are not going to get a very good audio because the closer you are to it, the better. And I'm not usually that close to my microphone. I also got this little mini tripod here, guys. When I saw this on the site, I kind of expected more, but I was a little disappointed because it just seemed like my phone would fall off. The legs are not that sturdy, you know. It's flexible, so I use it to watch movie even on my bed. I don't feel like it can break tomorrow. <laughs> it's cheap anyway. It's it's not expensive. I think I got this for with delivery fee. It was around two thousand something. So. I didn't feel too bad about it and as it is now i'm still going to be using it this is very perfect for vlogging i have my mini shotgun microphone on this and my phone on it and i can stand this way and vlog okay it's very good for vlogging and that's what i'll be using for vlogging for now till it gets bad and i need to get another one because i don't expect too much from this my area of strength is not in patience especially with new things just now I must have unboxed, done the actual unboxing, ripped it, turn it around, turn it inside out and all that. So it's even good because that way I can tell you everything about this because I've done my research, my personal research and experience kind of makes it more fun. So next time you see an unboxing video for me, I'm not going to say this again. <laughs> Just know that already that I already have these used. Okay, so it comes in this way, it comes in this pack. When I was making research, I wanted to get this. I went on YouTube to search for unboxing videos and reviews, but most of the reviews were in India, maybe Chinese, I'm not sure. But they were not in English, so I made up my mind that when I get this, I'll definitely be dropping a review. So those who want to get, who have a place to go to. I think I found one by a lady, I've forgotten her channel name. She made one by a nigerian lady she made a review for this and that was really helpful so i made up my mind to make this review for you in case you want to get this okay so it comes in this pack and um it weighs about 1560 gram and it can take a maximum weight of three kilogram you can handle your camera well and phones and um truth be told this thing kind of surprised me even though i try to watch youtube uh, reviews I was not still prepared for the quality I got, so it's, by my own opinion, it's actually a very, very good buy. It can extend up to 1,675 millimeters. You're going to see me demonstrate that, and you fold it as the minimum length when folded is 6,600 millimeters. It has a quick release plate that can help you attach your camera to it and get it off on time without so much um, screwing and all of that. Okay, so let's just open this. When I got this, I was so excited. It appears so sturdy to even look at. 
and um, it comes with a manual, but the manual is not in English. This is this is the length. Look at the length of my body. Okay, from my head this way. If I put it from my shoulder, it goes way down. So that way you can estimate. You don't know my height, but then this will still help you estimate the length. Because as I was watching it and checking the pictures, it appears tiny, but this thing is not tiny at all. It's not tiny. Okay, so to extend the length, I love this leg. It's sturdy and it's kind of. Can you see this? It kind of moves around, so when it's spread, it's readjusts, so that way it's quite sturdy on the ground, it cannot slip easily. And even the legs are firm and strong. I can't compare it to the one I was using before. This like, even at its thickest point, it's not this thick, but then this is the thinnest part of this stuff right now. Um, so uh, it's quite sturdy, it does not appear cheap, it looks quite professional. And I'm extending the legs. So when you extend, you kind of close it back up here. So by extending all the legs, I get this height. I get this height already. This, this is already way longer than the other tripod for me. This is way longer. And I love this top a lot. It kind of just appears really nice and professional. When you turn this, it allows this to fall back almost 360 degree is it up to that okay 180 degree so it can really turn your camera downward so once you get to the position you want you screw the handle back i don't know what to call this but i'll just be calling it handle so that way it doesn't move around any longer so also you can turn this screw around and get to lift this that's if you want your you want a vertical view as opposed to a horizontal view so you can turn this this way once you get to the position you want you tighten it back to hold it in place you can turn it to a particular point and decide to screw it and it just stays at that point without you know falling backwards and uh, also at the top here we have a quick release plate you see this you can release this handle and it just gives you this out directly doesn't come with this holder for phones so I'll be using the one on this mini tripod here so to screw this on um, on the on this quick release plate you hold it in place there's a screw behind right here and that's where you hold and turn hold this tightly and then you fix it back Okay, so that way it can't come off it's tightly fitted and all of that so let me turn this this way so there's a knob here when you losing this knob it allows this head turn around like you can just basically keep turning it around and once you get the position you want it to remain stable you hold it back i just love the control you have with this like you are in so much control of a lot of things here so another thing here is um, it has this handle, you know? So when I need to change position, you can easily hold here. I just love the handle. Kind of makes it easier to move around. And there is also this knob. This is quite exciting, but let me show you how it works. So this knob here, you can pull it upward and it allows you further increase the length. So you, you're losing this screw-like stuff here. Just release the screw and that way you can keep rolling and it just keeps going higher, higher, higher. Oh, this is higher. This is actually taller than I am. So you can get this length. So you can see it's not firm right now. What you do is to close it back up. So you close it back up and tighten this so that way it's firm again okay it's firm again and uh, you may then want to turn i've already shown you how to turn this downward tighten it back release it you know you can do a lot with this length right so i don't know i don't know what you'll be filming that this window if it's a cooking video if it's a sewing tutorial if it's anything this will just work so well i love it i absolutely love this item such a good buy and i got it for twelve thousand five. no twelve thousand on conga so when you're true with this length you release this again as you're losing it so that allows you move it downward 
you have these lanes, you tighten it back. So the fact that you can release and hold things in place just makes everything exciting for me. This item, I would say get it absolutely. As at the time I got it, I was like, oh, oh my God, what have I been suffering for this long? What have I been waiting for? This thing has been available and I was struggling, you know, with getting a stable tripod and moving things, having to put my tripod on my table, limiting the space I have to work on, especially for my sewing tutorial. So with this, I can sit down comfortably and make videos. I can decide to stand up and make videos. It's just so convenient and very easy to use. By the time you pull in all the legs, it can still serve as a travel tripod, a professional travel tripod that can hold your camera, your phone well, and it's also easy to move around. This bag, guys, appears quite nice. The quality is much nicer than the one I had before. So it's, I expect it to last a little bit. So you just need to get a phone holder when getting this, and um, you'll be fine. So that's it with this tripod, which is the major aim of doing this video. I hope someone somewhere who wants to get a Wi-Fi Oh, bad me. I haven't even given you the name. We think, I hope I'm pronouncing this well because it's Chinese. We think 3560. Please go ahead and get it. I endorse this. Go ahead and get it. The material, the bills, everything is commendable, really. So I'm glad. Ow! I forgot to tell you something. You see this that can move when you spread the leg of your tripod. You can actually hold it so it doesn't move again. Or if you don't want to make use of so much space, you can release it a little bit. Just make sure the legs of your tripod are still wide enough to be stable. Then you tighten it so it doesn't keep moving around. I just love everything about this tripod. So once you're done, you release it and close it up and you have this beauty right here that can go right back into the bag. Can you tell I'm excited? Yeah, this thing excites me. It has been exciting me. It will continue to excite me as long as I continue to use it. Um, okay. So that's it with this video. If you're here to subscribe to this channel, please hit the subscribe button. There's a tiny bell just beside the subscribe button where you should click and that way you get notified every time I upload a new video. Thank you and see you hopefully in my next video. Bye. -bye.